sorry guys, we leveled without you. Aftermath. It's so hot. Daddy's hooking up electric so we can get some ace. E. Okay, watch out, Baze. I need to get back there. I know you want your water, right but you gotta move. So I'm gonna get the slide so I can put down her water. Oh. And some aggressiveness, huh? Some aggressive behavior, I see. I love how, okay. This stayed, guys. And we're off. A few things will probably fall back there. Like the Lysol wipes. It's definitely gonna fall. But not the ones in the cabinet. <laughs> but that's, the, that's how it is, right? In use. We're getting ranch. Well, I see we need it. And there we go. That's all she wanted. That's it. This is the first time putting it back together. So, I'm not really sure. It's a little chaotic, and this is why I haven't been filming. It's a lot to learn. Cool because I gotta put bread up near you anyways. I also am still trying to figure out how like to talk to you guys, narrate this, how I want that to look. To be honest, this whole film and stuff scares the the bejeebus out of me. Okay, the bejeebus. When life gives you lemon. You make lemonade, right? Talking to everybody, letting them know why I must vlog. You got to plug in the microwave so we can mark away. Also, who loves tomato sandwiches? Right you sliced your thumb? How? Well, don't be doing that. Can you kiss me, a baby? I ain't kissing that. <laughs> I don't kiss boo boos that are bloody. Oh my god, you guys have a dirty thing on you. It's all this footage trash. Here you guys go. Here, you guys need proper treatment. <laughs> Sorry, I'm not good enough. Look, you wanna see what the chef looks like now? Bum ba ba ba. Alright, I'll see you guys later. We're gonna chill out. It's been a uh... It's been good. It's not wait, how would you say the move has been? It was actually really good. Come here. The only sketchy part. I mean Detroit bleh, Detroit construction. Detroit drivers. Yeah. Um that's the only thing. Just the usual. Well, I don't know what that rattle or crack was, but hey, well, yeah. find out when they stop. I think it was way better. Like, I feel, I don't want to say it out loud, but I'm gonna, so I can communicate. But I felt, I feel like it's getting, we're getting more used to it, and not that it's getting easier, but it, we're getting used to it and adjusting better. Yeah, we know, like, the main things to do, check. And one of the biggest things, I must say, Adjust yourself, because you're probably the issue. Just slow down. Yeah. Mistakes happen. Words like from Mark is, uh, go as fast as you want to crash. <laughs> so, you can go slow here. and take your time. I never want to crash. Should we hit this place or are you going to chill out? Just go to the beach. <laughs> no. Yeah. Come on, let's get and it's only been two seconds but check out our view this is the first time we've had a view it's not like view but it's it's view to view with something other than a trail <laughs> yeah well here that is lake erie currently in michigan what today's date Captain Vlog, Star Day 13th. 
Today is try to fix the shade day. I've already taken off the frame. It's right there. I did it all by myself. So now I'm gonna try to figure out why this one is broken there in this little spot. And if I can fix it, I think I might be able to fix it, to be honest. This might be easier than I thought. Okay. I will have to replace that part. Yeah. But I can do that without restringing it. Because the string's right there. So that's good news. So this string right here is supposed to pull out into this. And this keeps it against the wall or like holds it down, but it's broken. Which allows it to lift and stay and stuff. So, I thought I was going to have to restring this whole thing. Which would have been a Dave's puzzle. It would have been a puzzle. But I think I might be able just to replace that little plastic part. So, let's see what we can do. This kit, I bought one. But this one, we found already in the RV. So, I'm hoping just to take, like, one of those... The screw that's already there and just string it down. We got the window open because you can hear the waves at the beach. The beach right over there. Um, oh. I gotta work on that. Can I take this off? What I would do, I need to like cut, just send it through, then we knot it. How do I make that knot? Make that knot. Okay, and then tie the end with a knot. Camera, did you see that? Oh my God. Ocean. Just kidding. Thank you, Ari. But it sounds the same. Oh, and look, guys. There she is. Beautiful Bilu. We haven't named her yet. But I think it should be doing something with blue and big and big old blue. I don't know. But she's cute. Oh, look at that beach, guys. Tell me that isn't nice. That's so that is that big big part of the beach is the, like the actual state park beach. And then all the way down there where there's that little cove. That's that's where the campground beach is. I think we can use it. So nice. Soft sand. Little rocky getting in. You can definitely hurt your feet, but once you're in it's soft sands all the way. Basil's getting a little scared of these waves. But 
Looks like it dead ends down there. I kind of have to take a peek because of all the water. So we're turning around. Come on, let's go back. She said, yeah, just get you know, away from these waves. <laughs> Basil. And I say let's finish the walk with Russell. I think he'll really appreciate this. And I gotta finish it with him, don't I? Picking up where we left off yesterday. Water is way calmer. And I brought Russell because we had to share it with Russell. It's raining, misty. And the prize at the end is a frog. A cookie monster. Looks like a, a sad little frog. He's an angry frog. He's got eyebrows. Sad frog. We walk the distance. Ignore the pollution. Still not a bad view though. Not bad at all. Basil enjoyed it. But this is just a lunch walk, so we gotta get back. I'm gonna focus on the road, but maybe I'll pick you guys up when we land. See ya. Uh. Uh. 